Yo, what's up guys, DJ Hoops, back in another video. Um, so today I was scrolling on YouTube just now, and I found a video on Bleacher Report. It's called Shaq and D-Wade leave Luka Doncic out of West All-Star Starters Picks. So if you guys saw a video from me like two weeks ago, um, one, I think it was over two weeks ago, I, um, the first, one of the first days, um, the All-Star voting was up, I did an All-Star voting game. And I picked my stars for each of the conferences. So today we're going to be comparing our starting lineups for each of the conferences to Shaq and D Wade's version. Um, if you haven't seen that video that I had up from two weeks ago or something like that, make sure to go check it out. I'll leave the link in the description. So without further ado, this will be a short video. Let's check this out. All right, let's see, boys. All right, looks like we got the East first. So Shaq picks Bradley Beal. I did pick Bradley Beal. He also picks James Harden. I picked James Harden. Takes KD, Giannis, and Embiid. So Shaq and me have both the same um, starting lineup. So that's kind of I'm. Me and Shaq are on the same page here. Um. All right, makes me feel good. Um, I, you, like, I, when I was picking my players, I was like, you gotta take the top scorer in the league. Um, everyone would want to see James Harden play. I mean, he's a fan favorite. KD, MVP candidate. Giannis, back-to-back -back MVP. Joel Embiid, dominant force, has been great this season. Alright, D-Wade took Beal, Irving, Durant. Giannis and Embiid. Reason I didn't pick Kyrie mostly because he misses. He's like missed ten games this season. Um, when he's out there on the court, he's absolutely talented player, man. But uh, I think Harden's done more to help the team win, and he's been there more um, often. So um, yeah, I could see why D Way picked him, but I do like that I um. Have the same Shaq. Here are the starters that Shaq and D Wade came up with. Pretty much the same across the board, except Shaq, you're going with Harden. Wade, you're going with Kyrie. Shaq, I'll give you the floor first. Why Harden over Kyrie? Because Harden has made a lot of sacrifices. You know, he's part of a team that's known as the Big Three. He's, you know, he's All right, so Shaq's saying that he picked Harden because he's made a lot of sacrifices. He's helping the team win more. Um, I do agree, um, Harden's dishing out 11 assists a game, um, definitely a good point there, Let's see what else he has to say. Yep, that is exactly what I was looking for, he's changed his game a little bit for the better, um, so James Harden scoring like 35 points a game for the Houston Rockets, um, got traded, um, now has KD, Scoring like 30 points a game, I believe. Kyrie also scoring like 27. James Harden. Um, actually running the point guard, even though he's a two guard. Um, he's a better passer than Kyrie is. Kyrie did even say that he wants to run the shooting guard. Um, so yeah, good points by Shaq there. He's the NBA in assists. Okay, let's see what D Wade has to say about why I picked Kyrie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, I, the only other name, the only other name that could be there was Jalen Brown. Uh, he said Jalen Brown's the only other name. Jalen Brown definitely deserves to be an All Star this year. Starter, I would like to see. I'd love to see. You know, guys, I'm a Celtics fan. Got my um, KG jersey t-shirt on. Um, yeah. All right, we got the West. So Shaq made some good points. Um, so basically, D Wade had to pick between Harden and Kyrie. Picked Kyrie. Nothing wrong with that. Um, uh, so I did have the same Eastern Conference starting lineup for the All Star game as Shaq. Moving on to the West. Taking a look at Shaq's pick, he takes Curry, Lillard, Leonard, James, and Jokic. Exactly what I had. 
but D. Wade picks D Donovan Mitchell to play the small forward. Mm, Donovan Mitchell having a great season, one of my favorite players in the NBA, but I do think that um, Kawhi, I mean, you obviously can make a uh, argument um, for Donovan Mitchell to start, but I feel like Kawhi is just like, he's not the most fun player to watch, obviously, but he's just a winner. Um, but I do see Donovan Mitchell um, can be, actually thinking about this, Donovan Mitchell also can, is the reason why this um, Utah Jazz team has won, like, what is it, 16 out of the last 17 or something like that? It's crazy, bro. They're like 22 and 5, I don't even know at this point. Um, Curry obviously deserves it for carrying the Warriors. Lillard taking a lot of a big load of the scoring without CJ. Kawhi doing what Kawhi does. LeBron doing what LeBron does. And Jokic, man. <laughs> Upped in scoring this year. Um, we obviously know he's a great passer. And he's uh, carrying the um, Nuggets to a winning record right now. And Jokic just scored like 40 against my Celtics tonight. <coughs> Sorry about that, guys. Um, yeah, so nothing wrong with either of the guys' picks. So let's see what they have to say. He broke the rules. Supposed to be two guards, three forwards. D Wade goes three guards, two forwards. Yes. He's got to get Utah Donovan. has the number one record in the league, led by Donovan. Yep. Um, Dwayne Wade with a good point there. Number one record in the league. Mitchell scoring like 24 points a game, I believe, something like that. Definitely the reason why they're that good. So, good argument, strong argument for D-Wade. Mitchell is having an amazing year. He should be an all-star starter. But, you know, they're going to go by position. Neither of you have Luka. Yeah, they'll go by position, but let's see. So, the title is they leave out Luka, which I did. Um, no hard feelings to Luka, I hope. like. Like, I'm not even trying to, like, obviously Luka could play any of these three positions right here. Um, like, I feel like Donovan Mitchell and the Jazz have just been such a surprise this year. So. Shaq, thoughts on D-Wade's team? And, and My team don't get I like D-Wade's team, but rules are rules. Listen, Steph Curry's the number one point guard. Dame Lillard's the second. Donovan Mitchell Makes sense. He goes off voting, man. Like, if you guys saw my um, reserves video, I did. I take who I think's having a great season. I don't really go off favorites, to be honest with you. If I think they don't deserve it, they don't deserve it. It's alright, bro. It's alright. Lucas. Lucas started last year. Um. Not much to say, man. Um. Well, that was a quick video for you guys today. Um. I had it exactly the same lineups as Shaq did. Um. For both conferences, so. Me and Shaq are on the same page. Nice to see. Um, comment down below what you think about his picks. Um, what D Wade's picks were. Um, anything about this video. Also comment down below what you want me to react to next. Um, stay tuned for more videos. Make sure notifications are on. Catch you guys later. Peace.